Today, we're going to talk about the difference between the PoE switch and the PoE NBR. The PoE switch and the PoE NBR are two completely different products. Although, if you're wanting to set up an IP camera system, you're going to have to make a choice between these two. Now, let's take a look at these two. This is a PoE switch, and this is a PoE camera. I'm going to connect the PoE camera to the PoE switch in one of the core PoE ports. You can see the indicators are starting to blink. That means data and power are going through the cord and sending it to the camera. There is no need for an additional power cord. We can also connect our recorder to the PoE switch through the uplink port. Then we can record the video feed from the camera. This is one way to set up our IP camera system. Now let's take a look at the PoE NVR. The PoE NVR is a recorder which is integrated with the PoE switch's features. You can think of as the PoE switch is built into the PoE NVR. Now, let's connect the PoE camera to the PoE NVR. You can see the indicators are blinking. That means the camera is receiving power and data from the PoE NVR. And the NVR, we can connect an additional screen to watch the live feed. You can see the video feed on the screen right now. This is very, very like an analog camera system. But the benefit is, you don't need an extra wire. Even though these two are totally different products, when you use these two products together, you can make your camera system very flexible. In our next video, I'll show you guys how to connect seven cameras with one Ethernet cable. That's all for today. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any comments, please leave at the section below. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.